There's an interesting mechanic on the space land board where if you land on an event space, Womp chases all players in his path back to a specific location. The area that caught my attention was the Womp on the bottom of the map. Between the space where you start and the space where Womp appears, there is 14 spaces. On those spaces are two event spaces. If players keep landing on the event space, then everyone will keep getting sent back to the space at the start. So I had an idea where every turn I land on the event space and prevent anyone from being able to make it further than 14 spaces. Everyone would be trapped at the start of the board and restart every turn from the beginning space again. That means that you could only win using the resources that are available on those first 14 spaces. You can only get items from item spaces or lucky spaces and the only way to get stars would be from the bonus stars at the end. Or maybe a hidden block. So join me and see if we can win Mario Party without ever leaving the starting area. Okay, this is one of the few turns where I don't have to land on an event space, so hopefully we get something good here. Okay, it looks like we're gonna get a lucky space. Coins would be good, item we probably can't use, unless it's a custom dice block. Okay, that is completely useless. Our biggest rival, Luigi, he's gonna roll an 8, that's not a bad roll at all. He's gonna land on the item space, let's see what he gets. A cursed dice, okay, that's alright. Donkey Kong now, he rolls a 6, not too bad. And he lands on the red space. Last roll of the turn, we got Peach, she rolls the same as Donkey Kong, so they're both gonna be on red. Alright, first mini game of the match, it's a 3 vs 1, everyone against me. Now these mini games I think are going to be pretty important because obviously no one's going to get any stars so it's all going to come down to the coins and the bonus stars. The best way to get coins is to win mini games so that's what we're going to do or at least we're going to try. And if we're lucky we'll get either the coin or the mini game bonus star. It looks like we're going to win this one. Only a couple seconds left and we're good. Alright get ready for the first event space. That's another bonus star we're going to be hoping for, because we would definitely win that one. This is the furthest we're going to make it on the board for the whole match. Because we're all going back to the start. Alright, here goes Luigi, he's going to roll a 5. That is not going to be enough to escape. Donkey Kong's also going to roll a 5. I imagine there's going to be a lot of jewels later on. And Peach is going to roll a 4. Not a lot of high rolls this turn. Let's see where she ends up. That's going to give her a lucky space, so she could get some coins here, which she does need. And she gets 15 coins. That's pretty good. Okay, our first free-for-all minigame, Catch You Letter. Shy Guy is having a mental breakdown, and we have to help him pick up all these letters. Luigi already on two somehow, and DK. Shy Guy is avoiding me as much as he can. It's a tie game so far. Oh, but we're going to pick up a little love letter. Shy Guy likes those. Likes reading people's love letters. It's probably a letter from Mario, if I had to guess. But we've got a pretty good lead now. Only a few seconds left. Oh, we get another love letter. So that puts us on 12. Easy win. Back we go, team. Back to the start again. Whoa, Luigi rolling a 10. That is not unusual behavior from him. He is clearly going for the Sightseer bonus star. Donkey Kong also getting a pretty good roll. The computer trying their best to escape my little prison, but it's not going to work. Let's see what item DK gets. Okay, another useless skeleton key. Three big rolls this turn. Peach getting a nine. So she will also get the item space. Let's see what she gets. Nothing. Alright, if you don't love this minigame, there's something wrong with you. Go see a doctor. Oh, we just bully Luigi straight off. Peach suicides because she doesn't even want to take us on. And DK barely puts up a fight. Back we go. You guys thought you could escape, but you can't. Let's see what Luigi does this time. Only gets a six. That's still okay. But unfortunately, puts him on the red space. Oh, Donkey Kong doing my work for me. He's had a change of heart. He's decided, you know what? Maybe staying at the start the whole match isn't so bad after all. That means the only one to escape this turn will be Peach, and she gets a pretty good roll. But I think next turn we might be able to venture out a little bit. Okay, 2 vs 2 team minigame, Puddle Paddle. I don't think I've ever played this minigame on one of my videos. Not a minigame that we get very often. 
but there is some clear bias going on because the Hammer Bro threw a coin bag straight to Luigi and DK. He's obviously a Luigi supporter. And you can't really blame him. Team Luigi has a lot of wins under their belt. But there's a loose money bag over there, and we're going to be able to claim that, which means we will get a few more coins than the other team. Okay, this is quite an exciting turn because we're going to risk it all. We're going to go for a little walk, have a change of scenery, and land on something other than an event space. No way! Give me a star, please! Oh, that would have been so epic! Luigi rolling a 5. He's still holding on to that cursed dice block. Not sure when he's going to use that. DK gets an 8. That's not bad. I believe that puts him on the item space. You never know. He could get a golden pipe and change the game. But he gets a mushroom. Probably not going to help. If Peach gets a big roll here, she's free. But instead, she takes us all back to the start. I'm getting a lot of help from the computers this match. That means next turn we will be able to venture out again and maybe find another hidden block. The moment you've all been waiting for, Team Green in action again. Me and Luigi haven't teamed up for a while, but you just know it's a guaranteed win. We have never lost a minigame together, and today will be no different. Peach is out, me and Luigi not even breaking a sweat. Oh, and DK's out, just ignore Luigi getting hit at the end, doesn't matter, we win! Okay, halfway, only five turns left. Everyone is still at the beginning, so things are going very well. We also have the most coins, which is good, and we're on track for a few of the bonus stars, so, so far so good. Donkey Kong's gonna get picked to win, but he only gets 10 coins. Oh, there's so many things that could have helped him there. All right, normal roll this time. We get a four, pretty small roll, but that's all right. Let's see where we land. A lucky space, okay. There's not a lot of items we can use, but some coins would be good, I guess. Okay, seven coins, that's fine. All right, Luigi rolls a three. That's a pretty low roll as well. I believe he'll also get a lucky space. Let's see if he does better than we did. He's not too far behind us with the coins, but he gets a custom dice block, okay. DK gonna use his mushroom. He could get a big roll here. But he only gets a 2, which means he gets 7 in total. If he had rolled a 10, he may have escaped. And Peach rolls a 3, so we're going to have our first duel already, only on turn 6. My money's on Luigi. Peach is betting it all. 41 coins, that's everything she's got. The winner of this duel will almost be in first place. In fact, if Luigi wins, he will be in first. And he probably will. Oh, but Peach wins. I was wrong. That means Peach is only 7 coins behind us. Free for all minigame, crazy cutters. We're cutting out blooper, which is in my opinion, probably the hardest one. There's just so many little tentacles. Little squid tentacles. But uh, I would say we're doing pretty well compared to DK and Peach. But Luigi's not looking too bad. Uh, except the end there, he's kind of gone off the rails a bit. So I think we should win that one. Let's check the scores. It was a little bit rough around the bottom, but we should get 90s. 94, yeah, that's pretty good. Back we go, fun's over. Back to the start again. Oh, Luigi's gonna use his custom dice block. I wonder where he's gonna land. Rolls a six. Is that a lucky space? Or a red space? Okay, interesting strategy. Donkey Kong rolls an eight. He's had a few big rolls this match. I'm pretty sure that's the item space. It is. Let's see if he gets anything good for once. It's another skeleton key. All right, last we have Peach. She rolls a three. That means there won't be any jewels this turn. She does land on the lucky space though. 15 coins would put her in first place. Oh no, she's taken the lead. All right, we have another team mini game, Itch and Catch. This is another game that we do not play very often, but it's kind of fun. Both teams getting a point at the same time there. This was pretty close. Okay, we get another point there. DK and Luigi struggling a little bit. We should get another one here. That's three. DK and Luigi on two. We should be able to get one more before the time's up. Okay, four, three. I don't think they'll get another one. Oh no! On the last second. It's gonna be a tie. So I think everyone gets coins. Back to the beginning we go. 
Everyone back to the start. Luigi using his cursed dice block. He's been holding on to that for a while. And he uses it on us, which is fine. Because we need to roll a one anyway. So, thanks Luigi. Always looking out for us. And he rolls a one. But everyone is already at the start. Okay, DK rolls a six. I could be wrong, but I think he's moved the most spaces so far. Peach rolls a six as well. She's a real jewelist today. She's going to get another jewel. She already has 107 coins. How many is she going to bet? 50. She's going for all of DK's coins. Please win, DK. Or she's going to be very rich. Oh, no. She's won again. She's going to have 157 coins. That's going to be very hard to catch. Roll call. Let's do a quick head count. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18 by the looks of it. The toads, I think, are probably the easiest ones to count. I don't know what Peach was looking at, but she only counted 8 toads. Donkey Kong, the only one getting kind of close. Back to the start. Let's go. Two turns left. Luigi rolling a 7. Hasn't done a lot this match. Things really went downhill when he lost that jewel. Donkey Kong pulls out a 10. He's definitely getting the biggest rolls. But he only has 3 coins. And 2 skeleton keys. Peach getting an 8. That's a pretty good roll as well. We somehow need to beat her on coins. But I don't know how. It's not going to be easy. Let's see what she gets here. A warp block. Okay, not that useful. This is how we get back into first place, guys. We're playing Hammer Drop, a coin mini game, And already we've got 15 coins. We can easily get around 60 coins here. This is exactly what we needed. Oh, almost missed that one. Oh, Luigi got a money bag. And Peach got a money bag. Luigi gets another one. But that's fine. We're still doing really well. Donkey Kong's having a bit of a tough time, though. No money bags for him. Alright, back we go for the final time. Turn 10. Luigi rolls a 2. Not a great way to end the match. But he's done his best today, and that's all you can do. Donkey Kong rolling a 4. Will we get one more jewel before the game is over? Let's see how many coins he gets from the lucky space here. Could get quite a lot, but he only gets 10. Unlucky. Peach going to use her warp block. Not a bad idea. That will give her a slight head start, but less likely to get a jewel that way. Let's see what she rolls. Gets a 5, okay. And lands on a normal blue space. Final mini game, Snow World. Still yet to get the max score on this mini game, but I'll get it one day. This is not my best work, but I think it will be enough for first place. Not even close. That is an easy win for that one. All right, the final announcements. Bonus stars have never been so important. Let's see what the first bonus is. It's the Sightseer. I think that's going to be Donkey Kong. It's definitely not going to be us. It is Donkey Kong. That's what I thought. That means we have to get this next bonus star. Or there's no chance. The Slowpoke bonus! That's definitely us. We got so many ones to land on those event spaces. And that's all we need to win the match. Just one star. And a lot of coins. So for possibly the first time ever, Luigi will come in last place. Peach is going to be in third. Even though she won all those jewels and had all those coins. Donkey Kong somehow ended up in second place. Which means, of course, we win. Let's take a quick look at how many spaces everyone ended up moving. Pretty interesting stats, but we definitely ended up moving by far the least. So we were very lucky that Slowpoke was one of the bonuses.